close to seven years now, there's always something comic on a trending issue here. And today, I'm speaking to the actual animator and creator of Tales of Nazir, that's Louis Apia. You're very welcome. Thank you. Good Thank day. you very much. Thank you very much. Great to have you. <laughs> yeah. I thought that when I, I, I'd see you, you'd look quite like Nazir. Uh, it's just left with the, you know, blonde on top. And I, I know, think right? <laughs> you're quite the person. Did you pick your own image to create Nazir? Well, you know, um, artists usually draw subconsciously characters that look like them. Ah. Yeah. yeah. I just drew Nazir. I didn't even know it looked like me in any way. Have I still doubt it looks like you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it kind of looks like you. You just have to dye your hair and I think we're good to go. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Let's talk a bit about your work. You dwell a lot on, on comedy. I've seen other things though, but mm -hmm. comedy seems to stand out. It's like the, the most of what you do. Mm -hmm. uh, would you call yourself a comedian? No, 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 no. <laughs> well, well, maybe to some extent. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. But I'm an animator. I just pour comic exaggerations to social issues. Okay. Yes, yes. Some people actually don't do it all, all in one. They have someone who writes the story, mm -hmm. someone who breaks it down into a script, mm -hmm. and then people who do the voices, mm -hmm. and then people who draw it, and all of that. Are you all in one? Uh, well, apparently, mm -hmm. yes, I am. Hey. Yes, yeah. But, you know, I work with a team. Yes. Okay. So sometimes they help. Yeah. Okay. But uh, majority of the projects, yes, it's a one-man show. Okay. So so yeah. they help with what the animation or you do most of the animation you yeah. do all of the animation yes yeah, sometimes okay yes but i have a team that helps with the animation right. uh, with the editing and okay. the visual effects yes and how long does it take you to produce something like what we just saw okay so what we just played it took me about two months to put it all together yes yes and so with your team how many videos then can you put together to um, bring out because you do you know release them quite mm -hmm. often mm -hmm. so how it, depends, many mm -hmm. it depends on the concept. Yeah, for instance, um, uh, uh, two days ago, I just put out uh, my trailer for Book of Eden. It, yes, uh, yes, yeah, yes, It's yes, for yes. my movie I'm about to premiere this April. Wow. Yes, and that has taken me, like, I don't know, almost two years. Wow. Yeah, so um, I just put out the trailer, which took me about four months or four and a half months to, to put, put together. together. Yes. And is the, the trailer is scenes from the main movie. Yes, so, exactly. So you've had to have, have you fin have you finished the movie? No, no, no. We're still working on it. Yes. So you've had to go ahead of yourself more or less to put all those pieces together exactly, to get exactly. out to get yeah. the trailer. Yeah. Amazing. I wanted to talk about the book of Eden much later, but since you've brought it up now, <laughs> I I've seen that you're you're taking it from you're taking the creation story, mm -hmm. the the story of Adam and Eve. Yes. That's really what it's centered around. Yes. For the whole, is it one hour, two hours? One and a half hours. One and a half hours. Yes. That is just what you're looking at. Mm -hmm. is, is, did you get a revelation of some sort to put the, the, the story together? Um, okay, so I've always been intrigued about the Adam and Eve story. Mm -hmm. Yes, and I wanted to change the narrative. And also pushing the you know black agenda or uh, black power you know so <laughs> as you can see we have Eve with the natural locks yes yeah, and being African long locks yes yes and we have the serpent or the, or the devil yes. being Caucasian or white oh yeah yes yeah. and we are we, we are changing the narrative yeah. you know <laughs> yes mm, that's true I like the voiceover the very very strong serpent I was quite scared when I started watching it <laughs> but we have the trailer so that you don't miss out on the con on the conversation take a look at it. <laughs> <laughs> How are you? I've been trying to tell you something. It seems the kind of music you play in the house, the yo man, the hip life, and the scopa to something something. Emma, I'm gonna be fi ha kasa. Enko, do you like Nazi's playlist? Me, a shock. But what are we doing here? Hey, this woman. And you more don't play be fi. Then I said, no, you're not chena ma. Fried fish music. Hey, coffee. Is that you? Where's my money? Mommy, can I'm the boss apple. Kofi Kinata. Yeah. I heard his voice. Yeah. And saw the the the, the figure as well. Yeah. How did you get him to do it? Well, that's what makes Tales of Nazir unique. Hey. I actually get the real voice act to play the roles. Wow. Yes. And he's also a very good friend. Oh, uh, okay, yes, okay. Yes. <laughs> you, you have to throw that in. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, and you've been working on this for two whole years. You've, you've been in the industry for uh, close to seven years. Yeah. Have you, have you, you know, had any challenges? What so like, you, you, you must have felt, have faced some challenges. Pardon me. Uh, yes, you know, uh, Ghanaians were used to, were not used to um, having to advertise with animation. Yes. You know, and uh, seeing something of that sort, they 
it, it took a while to adjust. Mm. Yeah. But of, of course, like fortunately now, you turn on the telly and you see a lot of like commercials and animation and all yeah. that. So uh, we were sort of like the scapegoats. Yes. Yeah. So, uh -huh. so but I, I mean, hopefully, hopefully things will get better. I mean, it, it mm. is getting better. Yeah. Yes. I know the guy, I've, I've spoken to a few animators and they say they don't do it anymore. They tend to, to tend to do a photography, videography and oh, all, okay, all the okay, like okay, because okay. they say, yes, as you mentioned, Ghanaians don't like to pay for those things. Yes, it's too yes. expensive yeah. and things like that. But there must have been something that kept you going on. Yes, you know, yes. is it, what was that one thing that made you stay, regardless of the um, the income you were getting at the time mm -hmm. and all of that? What was the one thing that made you stay in it? Uh, my drive for my passion, I'll, I'll describe it as quite phenomenal. Mm. Like I, it's 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 something I'm 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 you know immensely passionate about. So I can't stop. You can't stop. Yes, I can't stop. Who's Even your inspiration? If, Sorry. Even if I have like a million dollars, I would still do what I do. Oh, lovely. <laughs> yes. And who is your inspiration? Uh, my inspiration is my senior brother. Oh yes, yes, yes. He he was the artist I I watched growing up. Right. Yes, yes. So I mean, I've always wanted. To, I've I've always looked up to him. I still look up to him yeah. now. Even even though he's not into the arts anymore. Anymore. Yes, but I still look up to him. And then I I I don't want to disappoint or fail yeah. by stopping what I'm doing now. Yeah. Yes. What kind of artist was he? No, he was a pencil, like a like a pencil artist. Right, 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 yes. right. And have you faced any attacks whatsoever um, from the kind of you know, content you put out oh, there again because lot. you're playing on, you know, current issues? A lot, a lot, a lot. Uh, people or individuals uh, belonging to other political parties mm -hmm. as well, um, having ill right. sentiments of me talking about their leaders and yeah. a whole lot. Yeah, but it's normal. It comes with it. Yeah. It comes with it. If it's not controversial, then it hasn't worked. <laughs> That's a good way to look at it. But how do you deal with it? Um, I I feel it comes with a job. Okay. Uh, I feel Ghanaians will just get used to it. Right. Yes. So I mean. But even after seven years, Ghanaians are not used to it. Uh, maybe to some extent. Mm. Maybe to some extent. But I have I I I have where I want to go. Mm. So that is the picture in my mind. Yeah. Yes. Um. I I don't really think about the fact that Ghanaians are not used to it or are used to it. Right. I have a picture in my mind or a dream that I want to see manifest okay so i mean that is that is that is my goal now right yes. can you paint this picture a little bit more for us this dream um so you see the way we have in the western world a little kid can boast of mickey mouse and bugs bunny yes and yes, yes, yes 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 um uh, i mean of course uh, we as africans we as Ghanaians, yeah. uh we can talk about anansi you could call anansi but uh you know anansi also belongs to other people if you go to jamaica they also have the anansi Yes, so, but we have an Nancy as well. Exactly. Just so if you go to Jamaica and you say, oh, okay, we have an Nancy, a Jamaican can also tell you, oh, Nancy doesn't belong to you, Nancy belongs to us. Yeah, that's but you true. can't go to America and say, uh, they have Iron Man. You tell them, oh, we also have yeah, Iron Man. Iron Man exactly. yes. so, we have um, Iron Boy, though. We have, <laughs> we have Iron Boy. <laughs> yeah, so um, 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 I want to create some sort of like lineage for real African characters yeah. you know, that are hailing from Ghana. Yes. Yes. And I'm, eventually we'll get You'll there. You'll get there. Yes. You're focusing a lot more on Nazir, though. Yes. You want Nazir to stand out as a certain character before you move into exactly. the other fictional characters. Exactly. Nazir well. is, for now, the one forefronting uh, 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 the movement now, if I should put it that if way. If you should put it that way. Yes. Let's come back to uh, the, the trailer, the, the scenes that we just saw, your new project. Mm -hmm. What exactly inspired it okay so i've always wanted to um tell the adam and eve story from a very um, unique perspective and of course um i got a call from circuit Safo uh to come up with a movie mm. um adam and eve yeah. yes so i mean he gave me a rough idea of mm. what he wanted but I just looked at it from a different perspective. And I, al I always like to stay away from cliché, something that is cliché. <laughs> so True. that's when I had to throw in a lot of uh, ideas and yeah. Eve being black and Eve having a dog yes. and a whole lot and snake speaking Hebrew yes. and a whole lot. So um, yes, 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 it will be exciting. Exactly. I, can't, I can't wait, I can't wait. To wow, see and the, the essence all in all though, what, what, what are we taking out of it? Okay, so we're taking, of course, we're pushing the black power agenda. Mm -hmm. We're pushing black power agenda. Um, it has some sort of, um, you know, for the fact that I interpreted the, the, the foot as being the devil, transforming and, you know, laying with Eve. Yeah. Yes. Uh, 
uh, you know, wow. I don't know if I should. <laughs> wow, I didn't know that bit. Well, I yeah, it's there, it's there, it's there. Wow. It's there. The entire story is about Nazir teleporting into the past yes. through a book mm. into the Garden of Eden. Mm. So he's like, he plays the character that is a first eyewitness yes. to seeing what actually transpired yeah. between the serpent or the devil and yes. Eve. And Eve yes. So right. that's what the Book of Eden is about. So when he gets to this, this garden, he cannot, he, this, the book is also there for him to teleport back to real time? No, no, no. The book is back in the present. Yes. Yes. But it was God who teleported him back. Hey, okay. Yes, yes, exciting. Yes. yes. So oh. it's, very, it's very exciting. I mean, back in the present day, he has friends like Hajjah for real, mm. Wendy Shea, hey. and the whole lot. They are all in it. So it's, <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's very interesting. Yeah. Wow. Well, we have a trailer that's ready and there's another video on bribery as well. Mm -hmm. So we'll take them and then we'll come back okay. uh, to conclude with this. You're a serpent. Yes. Yeah, I mean, I know you're a serpent, but are you talking to me? Precisely. So, did God say you must not eat from any tree in the garden? Yes, we may eat fruits from the trees in the garden, but God did say you must not eat fruits from the tree that is in the middle of the garden, and you must not touch it or you will die. Oh no 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 no, you poor thing. You most certainly would not die. In fact, that would be utterly preposterous. For God knows that when you eat of it, your eyes will be opened to the higher light. You will become a deity. You would be like God, knowing good and evil. <laughs> I've had a taste of it, and even I, a mere limbless creature, can now speak. Imagine what it would do for a mortal queen like you. God has not been honest. I know God. You do? Yes, I ruled with him. Not until you plunged me down from the heavens when he realized that I too had seen the light. Of course you wouldn't imagine the stealing a bite from a fruit of a tree is exactly what he meant now, would you? How do you mean? Let me show you. Snake talks. Amazing. You look like one of God's angels. <laughs> you insult me, mortal queen? A mere angel? I am my own god. Wow, you're so handsome. <gasps> Your middle leg is huge. Come to me, mortal queen. Don't be afraid. Eden. 
that's a whole other one. Right. <laughs> Quite scary. At the same time, you want to see what happens in exactly. the end. Exactly. Yeah. Lewis. Yeah. <laughs> you're not playing. I'm not playing at all. And I'm here <laughs> thinking that there's someone out there who also aspires to do something like this, mm -hmm. to be a cartoonist full time, mm -hmm. just do this for life. Mm -hmm. How? What, what would you tell the person out there? Um, the person should always find a way to feed their drive mm. for their passion. Mm. Yes, that's all I would say. That's all I'd say. Wow. And yeah. can this actually survive on it alone? Well, yeah, it depends on it. Like for me, I, I always find ways of feeding my drive. Yeah. Yes, yes. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> and they can do this cartoonist illustration as a full-time job here in Ghana. Exactly. They can. Yes. yes. Amazing. Yes. Amazing. Amazing. I'm looking forward to it. It's happening in, in April. I'm yes, sure we April. can follow you on social media to get more information. Yes. So yes. that's Tales. Underscore off underscore Nazir on Instagram. Hey. Yes. <laughs> Book of Eden. Yeah. I can't wait to watch it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, thank you so much for joining us here. Oh, thank you too for New having day. me.